Now one of the coolest walkways that I didn't show you is this. Basically you walk right through this boatyard shipyard and they do a lot of maintenance and repairs on this. So if you're walking through in the daytime like this one, they'll be working on this thing. You'll either have to stop and walk around them or see they got a big crane out now. The crane could be pushed to the side. So I guess they're scraping, repainting, maybe patching, whatever else they're doing. So yeah, basically that's about it. So this is a part of the pathway and you just walk right by where they're patching everything and repairing. Actually, this one's a pretty nice unit. Actually looks newer, keeping it in good shape. And I guess maybe they're putting a new back on it. Look at that, see? New, uh, yeah, wow, new engine mount. Oh, <laughs> there, the workers are all. <laughs> so funny, they're working away there. <laughs> it's pretty crazy so yeah we just keep walking by walking by all these uh, boats are being repaired are serviced and just keep walking by and there's a restaurant right in behind there you can see there's semi lineup oh motor out look at that motors hanging out so yeah it's pretty common oh see doing some fiberglass repair and repaint yeah oh vancouver chinese yacht cub how about that boatyard see welcome proceed with caution uh heavy equipment and operation so it's quite normal just to walk through crazy man so if you're a boat person how about this for a good setup actually i think that's their own yeah it's a backgammon game so they just set them tables out there and play away in the marina Maybe they have a boat here because they're rentals. Even the seagull there. Am I even pointing the camera anywhere? Oh my god. Sorry, I'm not paying attention a lot. Even the seagull's enjoying it. Yeah, they got a couple picnic tables there you can look at, sit and enjoy. Anyhow, continue on. Uh, I think there's nothing going on there till 8 o'clock. And it's just after 8 o'clock. So let's take a walk over, see if anything's happening. <laughs> Well, kids, I thought it was going to be boring and slow and I wasn't going to do much and it turned out a little better than I thought. So, you never know, don't judge things when you first see it, because things might turn out alright. Anyhow, time to go. Goodbye Bridge, goodbye Granville. How does this shot come in? I don't know if it's clear. The moon over the ocean front here and the science world in the background. It's in Buffalo on the bike. It's almost coming up like black and white on my camera here. That's uh, pretty funky, so I'm wondering how this is going to edit. I'm a shadow of my former self. Holy shit, that little scooter is flying. Wow, way faster than me. Holy, they're like kicking my ass. We're getting closer and closer. How long did it take to get here? Maybe five minutes? So we're booking along pretty good. Not as fast as the scooter, obvious, but hey, I'm in no hurry. Okay, we made it to the ball. Big balls are down here. Anyway, the train is right here, right beside it. So we enter there and that's it. We call it a night. Didn't I say that already? And then we got from the science center side. Hold on, there's a plane up there. Oh, it doesn't come in very clear on camera. But anyhow, yeah, the stadium looks pretty good from here. BC Lions and I guess soccer there too, I think the blue glow off the water that's actually the glow is pretty funky eh huh 
Yeah, I sanitized like three times, so holding a lot of hands and you never know. Okay, hope this comes in, but there's a whole pile of raccoons there. <laughs> Look at this. Hey, what are you doing, bandit? Hey, what are you doing? Huh? He's sitting there looking at me. Hey! Uh, he was going to come to me. Wow, crazy little creature. Could be rabid. Hey, rabies. Huh? Still sitting there staring at me. Oh, they're all running around. Oh, just wait. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, bandit. Hey, hey, bandit. Come here, bandit. They're thinking of coming. That's pretty crazy. Hey. I got something for you. Actually, I got nothing. Hey, what are you doing? Hey. Hey, bandit. Can you see that? There you go. Now it's coming in. Hey. What are you doing? Wow, he's like not far. Look at. Oh, he's chasing some a mouse. Oh my god. Hey, look at that. Chasing a mouse. The next day, later, 7.59 a.m. Okay, kids, it's uh, time to take my little monitor back. So this is what it is. It's, uh, yeah, they put it in four spots with a little controller that checks and records all the heartbeat and keeps it on a memory stick. So uh, I've worn it for a day, did my normal activities. Uh, Walking, I did some biking, did some dancing, did some sleeping, lazing around. So now, just a return time. Alright, we're at the medical clinic, so let us try and find a parking spot. That's the first thing on the agenda. And then check in. Wow, looks busy today. A lot of people. Everybody's fighting Corona. Okay, look at the big line up to the medical. So it's right back here, all the way down there to the life lab sign. Wow, super busy as usual during Corona time. Okay, and with that, that ends half of our first weekend in September already. Time is flying by and time to move on to bigger and better things. Uh, better than that, they have to send the results of my heart test away and the doctor will look at it and get back to me. So, it's a waiting game now. So my friends, thanks for chucking us out today. We'll catch you next time. Maybe, oh, I know what I got coming up. I have a friend coming to visit from Toronto. So, we'll video some of our escapades coming up as I show him around Vancouver area. Maybe we'll take them out to Whistler or out of town and check things out in around the local area. So we'll see what maps out in the next few days. So until next time, always keep staying awesome and echo echo. Cheers, my friend.